Are you feeling frustrated after attempting different methods to bring your desires into reality only to find no success? Have you been waiting for an extended period, hoping to see the outcomes of your manifestation endeavors? No need to fret, as this video provides the solution you need. By watching until the end, you'll uncover a straightforward technique that can assist you in manifesting your desires within minutes. Before we delve into the technique, I would like to ask you to support us by hitting the subscribe button. Our goal here is to simplify the process of manifestation for you by regularly sharing valuable tips and techniques. So let's get started. Neville Goddard, a spiritual teacher, explores the idea of states, explaining that there are infinite versions of every person and thing. When you transition from one state to another, your reality shifts and you transform into a new version of yourself. Quantum physicists also discuss this concept of multiple universes, or the multiverse, where an infinite number of universes exist, each with its unique characteristics. According to Neville Goddard, you are the creator of everything, and everything is within your control. You are the driving force behind the universe, making you a powerful influencer. Simply put, you are the universe itself, containing everything within you, including the multiverse, with infinite possibilities at your fingertips, each leading to a different state or a fresh version of yourself, you possess all the states, realities, and versions within your being. You can become whoever you desire and obtain whatever you seek, but it requires embodying a different state or embracing a new version of yourself. Just like there are countless versions of yourself, infinite possibilities are waiting to be discovered within you. If you're struggling to make ends meet in your current reality, imagine another world where you're living the life you've always dreamed of, with all your desires fulfilled and millions of dollars at your fingertips. In some alternate realities, you might be a successful doctor or engineer, while in others, you might be a thriving entrepreneur. The point is, there exists a reality where you have everything you've ever wanted and can become the person you aspire to be. So how can you bring that reality into existence? How can you embody that desired state? Well, here's the good news. The reality you want to manifest already exists, and you have the power to attract it into your present moment. All you have to do is believe that you're already living in that state, assume that you already possess what you desire, and let go of your current reality. Don't dwell on who you are or the circumstances of your present life. Instead, shift your focus to what you want to have. That's the key to achieving that desired state. As Neville Goddard once said, everything follows your focus. The more you concentrate on something, the more it materializes in your life. Therefore, don't fixate on your present situation, which may be filled with hardships and struggles, as doing so will only attract more undesirable experiences. Instead, concentrate on your desires, because by doing so, you're drawing them closer to you, and the best part is that it doesn't require a tremendous amount of effort or time. Even if it did, it wouldn't take long. The moment you wholeheartedly disregard your current reality and shift your complete focus toward your desired reality, you'll find yourself living in that state. It's as simple as that. Many people believe that achieving their desires means working harder or struggling more to get what they want. But that's not how it works. Manifesting is actually about letting go of the reality you don't want to live. As Wayne Dyer once said, we don't attract what we want, we attract who we are. This quote is fascinating, and if you grasp its meaning, manifesting your desires becomes easier. It's not about attracting what you want, it's about attracting who you are. It's important to understand that simply wanting your desire won't help you manifest it. The more you want it, the more you'll feel needy and attract more neediness. What truly helps in manifesting is the feeling of already having it. You have to wholeheartedly believe deep within yourself that you have already manifested your desire. You need to embody that state or become the person who has already achieved it. If you want to be successful, embody the state of being successful. If you want to be wealthy, embody the state of abundance. Right now, you might be wanting to manifest money, a job, or business success, but that wanting alone won't bring about manifestation because you're still in the state of wanting. You have to shift into the state of already having your desire. Are you the person who wants to become rich, or are you the person who is already wealthy? Are you struggling with circumstances, trying hard to manifest money, or striving to manifest a relationship with a specific person? Move away from the state of wanting and step into the state of having. The real question is, are you ready for the reality you want to live? Are you prepared to let go of your current situation? You deserve it and you are worthy of receiving it, but you have to fill your mind with a new reality. You have to fill your thoughts with the feeling of already having it, rather than wanting it. Like attracts like, 
which means that what you hold in your mind becomes your reality. If you continue to feel a sense of wanting, you'll only intensify that feeling without manifesting your desire. However, if you immerse your mind in the feelings of already having and experiencing your desire, manifestation becomes effortless. Having faith in yourself is the key to bringing your dreams to life. It's all about having a strong belief that you deserve the things you want. They are already meant for you. These kinds of positive beliefs are incredibly powerful and can truly make a difference in manifesting your desires. Unfortunately, many people doubt themselves. They think they can't make their dreams come true or that they're not worthy of them. They believe they don't have what it takes to achieve what they want. The problem is that when you have negative thoughts like these, you're blocking yourself from manifesting your desires. The most important thing you need to manifest your dreams is the ability to believe in yourself wholeheartedly. You must feel deep within that you deserve all the wonderful things you desire. They are already waiting for you. Have you ever seen someone who was once a millionaire but ended up losing all their money and becoming poor? What could be the reason behind this? Some people might say that it's because they didn't know how to handle their finances properly. However, the truth is different. The real reason is that they didn't believe they deserved the wealth they had. They didn't think they deserved to have millions of dollars, so they ended up losing it all in a short period. They didn't truly believe they were worthy of their newfound success. The same principle applies to relationships, careers, and businesses. As human beings, we constantly strive to achieve our goals and dreams. Manifestation is a powerful tool that can help us along the way. However, many of us carry limiting beliefs that hold us back from reaching our full potential. In this video, we will explore how to overcome these beliefs and manifest our desires. The first step is to recognize that our thoughts have no limits. Our imagination is limitless, which means that everything that comes into our minds is possible for us. We need to always remember this factor thoughts have no limits. Our imagination is limitless, which means that everything that comes into our minds is possible for us. We need to always remember this fact. If we think something is not possible for us, then we will not be able to manifest it. On the other hand, if we can think of something, we can manifest it. The next step is to deal with any negative beliefs we may have about our desires. We need to write down our negative beliefs about our desires and get to know ourselves. Knowing our fears, limiting thoughts, and negative beliefs helps us overcome them. We need to learn how to calm our inner spirit and stay relaxed. By living beyond our limiting beliefs, we prove to ourselves that negative beliefs don't define us. For example, if we believe that we deserve only $30,000 per year, we will not earn more than that. But if we think we deserve more, we can increase the amount of money we earn per year. Manifestation is not about changing the physical world but about changing our beliefs. We need to bring about change within ourselves. To do this, we need to stay calm and relaxed. When we are calm and relaxed, we can easily access our subconscious mind and change it. We need to believe that we deserve what we desire and that we are worthy of having it. Once we know that something is ours, it becomes ours. We need to know that we are worthy of our desires. It's essential to have the manifestation of knowing this. The moment we know that something is ours, it becomes ours. The moment we know that something can't be ours or that we aren't worthy of getting it, we lose it. We must know and realize that whatever we want is already ours and we can have it. Once we have such beliefs, we can see them in our minds, feel them, and then start living them. Another important belief that we need to have is that what we desire to manifest also desires us. We are not far away from our manifestation because it is already ours. This belief is rooted in the principle of the law of attraction, which suggests that like attracts like. When we align our thoughts, emotions, and actions with our desires, we create a magnetic pull that draws those desires closer to us. To manifest our desires, we need to calm our inner spirit and cultivate a sense of inner peace. When we are filled with anxiety, doubt, or impatience, we create resistance that hinders the manifestation process. By consciously choosing to release these negative emotions and cultivating a state of calm and trust, we create a conducive environment for our desires to materialize. Visualization and imagination play crucial roles in the manifestation process. By vividly imagining and visualizing our desired outcome, we tap into the power of our subconscious mind and send clear signals to the universe about what we want to manifest. This practice helps to align our thoughts and emotions with our desires, reinforcing the belief that what we seek is already on its way. In addition to visualization, making positive assumptions about our desires is essential. Instead of dwelling on doubts or limitations, 
We must adopt a mindset of positivity and unwavering faith in the fulfillment of our desires. By affirming and assuming that our desires are already being fulfilled, we create a powerful energy that accelerates their manifestation. It is important to recognize that the state of neediness hinders manifestation. When we constantly feel lacking or desperate for our desires to manifest, we create resistance and reinforce the belief that what we want is outside of us. However, once we shift our perspective and realize that our desires are already within our reach, we enter a state of alignment and receptivity. This state of knowing replaces neediness with confidence and we become open to receiving our manifestations. Manifestation is a process that requires patience, trust, and perseverance. It is not always an immediate or linear journey, but by maintaining unwavering belief in the inevitability of our desires and taking inspired action when opportunities arise, we pave the way for their realization. We must stay focused on our intentions, stay aligned with our desires, and trust that the universe is working behind the scenes to bring our manifestations to fruition. I hope I delivered a good analysis of this method by Neville Goddard, as he was a great teacher and inspired millions of people around the world. If you want to share your opinion, comment down below this video. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to it and press the bell icon for more interesting, informative, and helpful videos on manifestation. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video.